All right, hello, hello, everyone. My name is Super Dave, and um, I am based out of Toronto, Ontario. Normally, every uh, Sunday night, not every Sunday, every couple of Sundays, uh, I do a, a, a team training uh, for my group. And then I also open it up for other people who are involved in other companies as well. And um, uh, last week, I spent a lot of time on one company. This week, I'm going to uh, continue that with the same company as well, because there's a whole bunch of people from that company that are online today. Um, lately, I've actually been on the road, actually quite a bit. And um, for those of you who are on Facebook, you might have noticed I haven't posted anything in almost uh, six days from Facebook. And that's only because I've been out all day, all night, till maybe uh, 3, 4 in the morning, coming back, passing out, getting up again next morning, and getting back out on the road. So today's the first time I'm back early. Then it's just to do this webinar. So there's a bunch of stuff I wanted to do on um, on a website online and I haven't had the chance yet to do that so I will soon now um, last week I asked a bunch of people what your questions were like what kind of challenges are you having um, you know what is it that you want to know more about and I did a webinar on that. In fact, the webinar was a long webinar, but it went really, really fast because people just seemed to be really, really hungry for the information. And I got a gazillion different comments about that webinar, talking about how it's the best thing they've seen since sliced bread, and you know they can't believe no one else has uh, told them anything about it, and all this other stuff. So what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm actually going to post that webinar. Actually, let me find out here. How many of you on this webinar right now are not part of our team? Like you're not in the Vaisalus Project group. Okay, let me pull that up right now here where we are. Uh, uh, Facebook. Who here? Okay, one. Who else? Oh, what's that green screen? Uh-oh. I don't like green screens. <laughs> Let me see here. Okay, move all this. Green screens normally means like your um, computer is getting slower. Let me just unplug a bunch of different things here to make sure nothing happens. All right, who else? Who else? Who else? Uh, okay, someone else there. It is pretty green, right? Okay, that should be much better. Okay, who else? Uh, not, 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 okay. Anyone else who's not part of our Vaisalus project group? If you don't know what I'm talking about, let me pull it up here. Uh, this group here. This is where we have our team stuff. All right, some people put their hands up. All right, can you guys see my screen? I wanna be sure, first of all. Do -dum, do -dum, do -dum, do -dum. Yes, okay, cool. All right, so. Those of you who are not part of the Vaisalus project, um, I'm actually going to be uh, creating my training. And the link where you'll be able to see that training will be here. I want you guys just to write this down for now. It will be uh, workwithsuperdave.com slash VI for Vaisalus. Okay, again, workwithsuperdave.com slash VI. Okay, this is for everyone who's in the business and people who are not in the business. And what I'm going to do on this particular site. First of all, let me answer this quest question. Some people wonder, you know, Dave, if I'm not in your team, why are you willing to help me? Okay, I've had that question actually uh, uh, last couple of weeks. It's happened a few times. And um, uh, the reason why I'm sharing this stuff with you, okay, is because I believe as a whole, okay, and again, we all do things for selfish reasons. Let's just be honest, okay? But as a whole, I believe that if I can help you succeed in your business, okay, this is the reality, this is what happens. There are people that you will talk to that for whatever reason will not sign up with you. But they like the concept. They will go online and they'll go find someone else to join. Same thing will happen with me. There's people I'm gonna speak to that will not wanna sign up with me, but they'll go online, go do a research and go help someone else. Okay, that's just what happens. All right. 
So my belief is if I can just help you build the business, we're out there spreading the mission of Vicelous, helping people become healthier and wealthier because it is because of what other people have done that by what we're doing now, you know, all those Facebook stuff that we're doing and all the success that we're creating on our team, why people are coming to us to ask us, hey, listen, is it that buddy by Vi thing? Because they've heard about it from other people and just other people have mentioned stuff, but maybe people are not as serious in the business as, as far as we are, we were, but other people are out there spreading the news of this and they're looking for someone who's serious who wants to work the business. So I don't know where this is gonna go. I just know that instead of me keeping it just to our little group, I believe I wanna help the company as a whole grow. So that's why I'm helping whoever it is that wants to help, okay? So uh, that's why I do this. Now, uh, just be warned or beware, you know, I am sending you to my site, okay? It's workwithsuperdiv.com slash Vi. Again, this is gonna be all my training stuff that's gonna be on there. So, you know, if you're running with someone or if you're serious about the business, people will wanna sign up with you, okay? And the best way for you to position this when you're sending someone to the site here is you simply say, you know what, um, you know, I'm working with this individual, okay, and here's the information, okay? And you are working with me, whether you're my team or not, all right? So just so you are clear on that. So what I'm gonna have on here will be a, a, an intro video and you'll have links. One link will go to the webinar. So those of you who have teams and not part of our team, you'll be able to send uh, your people to the uh, training right here on my team site. I'm also gonna be working on some Facebook videos because we have a lot of new people who don't really understand how to actually create this whole you know, Facebook project type stuff that we have going on. So I'm gonna actually break that all down. And again, if you're not in our project and you're not on our team, nothing stops you from creating the same synergy within your group, okay? Uh, let me see, what else am I gonna put on here? Uh, there'll be that, that, and, are you ready for this? And, I shouldn't even mention this. You know what, forget it. I'm not gonna mention it. Nope, that's it. I will not mention this part. <laughs> um, I'm also gonna have testimonials. Uh, this this is not what I was gonna mention, it's something else. Uh, I'm gonna also have testimonials. Uh, people who are picking up their BMWs and stuff like that. I'm gonna have videos of that as well. So that way people wanna show social proof. You know, last night, uh, yesterday during the day, sorry, we did a challenge party. And what I normally do is I plug in my, um, my, uh, my phone or iPad onto uh, the TV monitor. And then what I normally do is I'll go onto Facebook and then I would go uh, look for the videos for a BMW and then I would then press play. So the first video, okay, that's all good. Second video, people are like, man, I need to get one of these. Third video, they're like, you know what? All right, that's it. I mean, this is incredible. So normally, if, if you remember the training, right, the pick two and party, people need to see two, three things before they can make a decision. So by the time you show them two and three videos, people picking up BMWs from your team, guess what? Now they know it's their turn next. Okay, so I normally plug in my phone onto that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna have a site where the, um, the there'll be videos, you'll be able to directly access those videos. And again, you can use it, doesn't matter. Anyone can use it because guess what? You just say, this is part of the team I'm with. Here's someone on the team who just picked up their car. Okay, so it's all about you taking ownership. All right, now, um, what I wanted to do, I again, I want to know what questions you guys have this week um, about anything about building your business. Please type in your questions because today I was going to go, uh, my, my next step, this training was going to be about, you know, now I'm in the business, I'm brand new, I just came on board, now what is my next step? You know, Dave, what do you tell new people who have just said, yes, you know, I'm gonna come on board. I'm a number three, what do you do next? And not just what, but how do you do it as well, okay? So again, if you're brand new and you don't know where the link is to ask questions, there should be a little box at the top right. Please type in the, um, the question, perfect. So see a question we have right now says, what is the best website to send a new prospect to? All right, that's a good question. All right, who else has a question? Type in your questions, please, 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 so that we can get this going. And for sure today, I will be done at nine o'clock, come heck or high water, okay? 
Uh, any one of you also, have you guys been having success posting pictures on your Facebook wall? Have you had any interactions? Anybody saying anything to you? All right, someone says, how do I overcome my phobia of cameras when I need to do my challenge videos? Well, I don't know. Do you do you have a like what happens when the camera is facing you? You uh, get scared. I don't even want to mention your name, but it starts with a C. <laughs> so what do you mean by your phobia? All right. Uh, someone else is saying, what do you say to strangers when when shopping, getting coffee, etc., etc.? Uh, do you, uh, I think so? Does you look for people who are in shape, or who people who need to get into shape? <laughs> ah, I like that. All right. Someone else says uh, I have had much more success since learning your new system. All right, that's cool. Okay. Well, um, for the person with the question on uh, with the person with the question saying, hey, "What? How do I overcome my phobia with cameras?" Yeah, you just take more pictures. All right, just uh, take actually, I'll well, take pictures and start trying uh, st start trying to do videos. All right, um, let me see if I can show you something here. Actually, not. Let me show you something here. Yeah, why not? Just before I show that, because I want you. I, you know, my name is Super Dave, but that doesn't mean I don't. I, I'm not learning stuff. I'm always learning things. Okay, so um, here I don't know if you can see it or not. So this here is a video that I was recording for uh, the website that I'm supposed to be working on when I can stay home. Okay, so here's the video. But you see this picture here, this picture here, and this picture here? Well, that is me doing the same video four times. All right? So the lady that I can't mention your name, I'm, I'm assuming, but last name is with, with a B. Um, you know, this same thing here I mess up on videos so you just kind of start doing one and then doing it again and doing it again and until you get better okay now I noticed so for example when I did this video here I wasn't smiling as much so guess what I may try smiled more sometimes you just get so focused and you're so excited about what you're doing but you're not smiling so I noticed that so I, I, I do my video I watch it again and then I do it again until I'm smiling all the way through okay and the point is I'm watching the video to see if it's something that I saw someone else doing, would I say that stay there and watch it? Okay. Uh, someone says I am. <laughs> you know, I'm going to mention your name soon because I'm telling you, this is just funny, and could not. But yes, oh, great. That makes no sense. All right. Uh, when someone is on another diet, must I research his diet before? Oh man, all these how-to questions. Person wants to know ingredients. Great. Okay, so I, all I'm having is a bunch of how-to questions. How, how, how. All right. Um, let me get my magic marker out, and then we're going to go into the training part because the training part is going to answer all these how-to questions. All right. All right. Now, here we are. with my magic marker? All right. So this is you. All right. And. That's your little eye and your nose and your and your mouth. All right. So here goes. And um, do, 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 do. Well, I made you too big. You know that. Anyways, let's do this here. All right. So this is you. You're looking at this here. This is your your obs. The cool. Is that how you spell obstacle? Obstacle. Obstacle. Well, you know what I mean, right? Okay, spell it for me. Uh, S T A C L E. Okay, so forget this. All right. <laughs> All right, so there. Proof point you don't have to know how to spell to build this business, okay? So that is your obstacle. Obstacle, right? All right. Now, this is this is what's happening. Okay. Um, this here, I had a different color here. This here is your why. Um, let us assume. Okay. 
This here is your why. Whatever it is. Okay. So maybe it's, it's you want to make more money. Um, you you want to uh, do something for your kids. You have bills to pay. You want to get a new car. You you want to prove yourself to your friends and family. You you just you want to do something. Okay. So here's the problem right now. Okay. Right now your your question is here is how how do I cross over this obstacle you know Dave do I focus on people who are look very very fit you know Dave what, what if people are very very skinny they don't you know they don't need to lose any weight and if people are very fit like how do I okay Dave so if I find people who I think could be good about this how can I how can I speak to them what do I say to them uh, you know, Dave, look, I, I want to do videos. I want to take pictures and put on Facebook, but you know, I'm scared. I'm, I, I have a phobia of cameras. I, all this other stuff. Okay. And this is the problem. All you can see right now is the obstacle. And the reason for that is because of this. Your why is too small. Okay. Like I said, I drew this guy too big. So you're going to see what I'm going to do next. You don't know yet why you need to go over this obstacle because you can't see your why is not big enough I don't know if you guys ever heard this before this is what you're looking for you need this why that it is so big that this little this thing becomes nothing because you can now see what you're trying to do okay and I'm going to give you a more drastic example right now, okay? Because right now, most people who have all those how questions, your why is this small. So you can't see what you're trying to accomplish right now. So everyone's, you're, that's why you're having a how type question, okay? So I'm going to draw another picture here so that you'll see what I'm talking about. Uh, let's do a new page here. Don't save that. Okay. Now this is a drastic, drastic picture, but I want you to get, I want you to see this, okay? Because after today's webinar, you will never ask me another how question because you will know what the problem is, okay? So here's the deal, okay? And I want you to participate with me. So um, again, this is you, all right? <laughs> we'll make you not smile, okay? So that's you right now. And you're trying to host a challenge party, okay? So these are the, the chairs of, of people. You're waiting for them to show up. Nobody is showing up at your challenge party, okay? So everyone's waiting here. Now, I'm again, uh, you're going to participate. I'm going to write down the numbers I'm going to get right now. So how many of you, or not, not how many of you, if I'm, if I'm going to be coming into your house tomorrow, tomorrow's Monday, okay? Tomorrow's Monday. Forget tomorrow. It's nine. It's eight. Eight twenty-four p.m. my time right now. So assuming I'm coming to your house at eleven o'clock tonight. Okay. So and I want you guys to see how drastic this is. Eleven p.m. tonight. I'm coming. Okay. I'm coming to your house. All right. I'm gonna come show what your business, whatever company you're in. I'm gonna come and show that that those are your prospects, whoever you have there. I'm gonna come show them your business. Okay. I want you now to type in there in the box, how many people will you have in your house by 11 p.m. tonight? And I want you guys to see what you're going to go through in this exercise. Okay, so again, just start typing in a number. How many people will you have at your house by 11 p.m. tonight? Do -do, do -do. All right, so I'm going to write down the numbers, okay? And I want you guys to see this, okay? So here's the numbers I'm getting right now. I'm getting uh, five. I got another five. Uh, five, I got one. What else? I got uh, three. I got two. I've got <laughs> someone saying 50. Okay, who else? Remember, you only have, you only have about three hours, two and a half hours. Okay, so let's be realistic. Who else? Just type in your numbers, and there's no wrong answer here. It's just what you believe right now. And watch, watch, watch me increase this number by 11 p.m. tonight for you, okay? 
So we got four, okay. Who else? Again, we're being realistic, right? We got two, okay. Anyone else? So realistic answers we're looking at, the, what we're seeing is between five and, uh, and um, between five and one, right? Do you guys see that? Okay, so we'll get another two there again. Okay, so this 50 here, I mean, that's a super excited person, but you know, we'll see. Okay, we'll see. Okay, who else? Anyone else? Last chance, give me your numbers. Hurry up. Okay, and again, just so, again, because I'm recording this, I'm just gonna show this. I hope it doesn't disappear. So you can see those are the numbers there. All right. Okay. All right. So that's, we all agree, this is what you can do for 11 p.m. 11 p.m. tonight. Now, check this out. <laughs> ah, please, please don't go on, don't hate me. I'm just trying to drive home a point. Okay? That's all. Now, this is you again. All right. And I don't know, I don't know what you guys have out there, but I'm just showing you. Now, you have your little son or daughter. And someone has a gun to their head and they say at 11 p.m. tonight I need to have 20 people at your house. Now those of you who answered before I want you to tell me how many people are you gonna have at your house at 11 p.m. tonight. And the rest of you guys who are watching this who did not answer before, type in the answer now that you would have by 11 p.m. tonight. Okay, keep typing. Now let me, let me write the numbers out that I'm getting. I'm seeing 20, 40, 25, 20, 51, 205 to be on the safe side. 20, 300, uh, <laughs> 25, 20, as many as it takes, 20 plus the cops, <laughs> and 30. Okay, let me just show you the answers again. Okay, so you can see the numbers there. Okay, because I'm recording the screen, I'm showing, I'm showing uh, the, the, the comments and returns. So you guys can't see it right now, but when you watch the recording, you'll see it. Okay, so now I want you, those of you, I just want you guys to see what happened. In less than three minutes, right? Everyone told me they're gonna get me from one to five people to come to their house. And all of a sudden, within three minutes, everyone now is telling me they're gonna get between 20 to 300 people to come to their house. Some people are even asking, how about online? Okay. What changed? The only thing that changed was this. The why. You see, when I asked you here, I can I can tell you the response was, oh my God, 11 tonight. I don't know, Dave. I mean, people sleep right now. Do you know? I have to go to work tomorrow. Uh, I, 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 he's not even really going to come anyway, so why even, I'm not even going to respond. Uh, you know, all these different thoughts. Who am I going to talk to now? I mean, I already spoke to the uh, same people already nine times, and they're definitely they don't know going to show up. You know, you guys, you, you, you had all this stuff in your head, and so that's what you're thinking of. But when the why changed, all of a sudden, reason went out the window. You would go to your neighbor. You'd wake up people. You would do whatever it took. And that was my point before, and too bad I, I raised the drawing already before, in regards to the obstacle you you think you're dealing with versus why. When your why becomes big enough, I promise you, whatever you're thinking about, how can I, what should I, all that stuff, all that's going to just disappear because none of that will matter anymore. Okay? 
I hope this makes sense. Um, I got to get into the training part now. If you have a question based on this, <laughs> I guarantee no one's going to ask me any more how questions. But does this make sense to you guys? Let me save this drawing just in case I need it later on. And why? All right. And save. Why? Why training? <laughs> training by why? All right. Uh, that's fine. All right. Cool. Now, let us get into the actual training. Now, my training is this. Not really training. Basically, it's what do I do after someone says, okay, you know what? Sounds good. Sure. I'm on board. All right. And I hope this works here. The very first thing I do is I do the GST training. And when do I do the GST training? I do GST training right after the actual challenge party. So uh, let me put a new picture here to draw it out for you so you understand how I schedule everything here. To of uh, course. <laughs> David, I can't even answer that question anymore because if you remember the why I just drew out, then you will come up with the answer. Okay? So, but anyway, let me go through this here and then, um, and then we'll come back to that. Okay? So, here's how I do a challenge party. Challenge party. Now, remember, I'm writing on my computer screen. Okay? So, ignore the bad handwriting. Um, first of all, Remember, this is where you're doing a party or doing a one-on-one. -on -one, it's all pretty much the same, okay? Now, when I do a a one-on-one, 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 because I do, you know, when I'm drawing things out, normally I'm aiming, I, I give it about an hour, okay? So what I do is I spend the first uh, 15 minutes chit-chatting with them, getting to know more about, you know, uh, who they are, uh, who they are, where they come from, what they do, what they do, and then why, why are they looking for something else? So to give an example, I would, uh, let's say I'm talking to uh, Sandra, okay? So I say, hey Sandra, how are you? I get to know if she's married, does she have any kids? What's going on? Uh, does she work? Where does she work? What does she do? What does she like about it? What does she not like about it? And then also I would go into, you know, well, you know, I'm going to show you where, how you can make some money, but why should I show you that? Okay. Remember, I'm not showing them nothing yet. And I, I or I'll say, look, if I showed you where, how you can make some more money, what would you do with that? You know, and then I would then, I'll, then ask them, well, why, why, why would you, why would you want to learn? Or why would you want to uh, uh, listen to what is I have to say to you? I want them to sell themselves on me. Totally different. Okay. So I'm getting them now to tell me, well, you know, if I could make this much, then I could do this. And what happens? They're putting themselves in a position to where they're actually hoping that you have the answer for them. Okay. So, uh, so 15 minutes of, of getting to know them, then about uh, 20 minutes to draw out my, my, my uh, quick presentation, which is what I shared in the training last week. And then pretty much after that, you know, we just chat about the BMWs and, and, you know, how we can get them into it, all that kind of stuff. Now, if it's a challenge party, okay, then I schedule two hours. Again, you already know the, the drill. It's 30 minutes to blend. All right, so people are coming in. You're blending three different kinds of shakes. To learn more about how to do all that, you simply go to party.vi.com. Okay, then what happens? We play the video. Video is 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 supposed to be 24 minutes long, but really, I stretch it to 30 minutes. Okay, and again, guys, I'm giving you all my secret. This is exactly what I do. Okay, those of you who've been to Channel Party, you know that. Okay, I play the full version, the full version, but then what I do is how do I do? I I pause. during the switch over, so halfway. I pause when Ashley is introducing Nick, okay? And then we give a product, 
product testimonials. Okay, so that's product testimonials. So what happens, we pause it and I get anywhere from one to three people to come up and give the product testimonial. And what that is, is, you know, hi, my name is Dave. Um, you know, I've been on a product for, for eight weeks. My goal is to lose uh, 19.7 pounds and so far I've lost uh, four pounds. Yay, thank you. Next, hi, my name is da da da. My goal is to lose da da da. My nine day challenge is to lose da da da. And I've lost this much so far, okay? So give about one to three testimonials and you're looking at maximum, max, max, max of two minutes, two minutes. And then we continue for the business part. After the business part is done, so done video. When that's done, then we um, uh, give again uh, one to three business testimonials. All right. So again, same thing, you know, I've been in for whatever length of time and I've been able to make back the money of my kid. I've been in this length of time. I've, I'm, I've hit the uh, uh, rising star director. I've been in this length of time. Again, three testimonials. Again, boom, boom, boom. Really, really fast. Okay. Now, when that is done, we ask the question, are you a one, two, or three? That is it. Now, this is what I do. I go, are you a one? That's someone that wants to take a challenge. Or you're a two, someone wants to take the challenge and get your product for free. Or you're a three, someone that would love to drive a BMW. Okay? So, one, two, three, and I use those wordings, okay? Because I'm trying to drive home certain things. So I tell them, look, if you're a one or two, that is great. We're just gonna ask you to get up and go to the kitchen, and they'll set you up with the kit that's going to fit your challenge. Again, if you're one or two, we're just going to ask you to get up and please go to the kitchen and someone that's going to help you choose the kit that's going to fit your challenge. Okay. Again, those of you who are brand new to this, you got to remember, we don't focus on the product. So I know someone had a question here for me before in regards to products and they want to check on ingredients and all this other stuff. All that stuff, let them go do the research on the ingredients. It's all on the website. Just go to Vysals.com, look on the products. You get everything about the products, the ingredients, how it's made, all that kind of stuff. That's not your job, and you don't want to get into that. You don't want to even make it your job, because if you do, you're going to create more questions around you on product-based questions. For me personally, I don't know anything about the product. I just know it tastes great, and it works, and people are getting results. I'm not a doctor. I just don't know anything about that. So again, one or two, please get up, and that's it. Then this is what I say. I go, if you don't get up, I'm going to assume you're a three, <laughs> and we're gonna be doing the training next. So again, if you don't, because I want them to get up, I don't wanna waste my time. I don't want to be talking to one and twos if they're not a three, you know? So again, if you don't get up, I'm gonna assume you're a three, and normally when I say that, you find the people get up, and then they go to the kitchen, all right? so. Um, you know, for those of you who haven't even had your first challenge party yet, that's a okay. You know, you can always watch this, and then now you know what to do. Okay, and when you do a few of them, you see it becomes a lot easier. All right, so uh, we do that, and then now the three, what we do next with those is now we go through the GST training. All right, so let me uh, save this here. I got any questions on this before I erase this here? Any questions? Any questions? Any questions? Uh, how is the presence uh, uh. okay all right all right no questions cool so I'm gonna just uh, new page here so remember now next step now is for the three okay for if you're one or two, what I would do is you simply ask them, okay, what's your challenge? What is your challenge? And depending, if they say they want to lose weight fast, or they want to train for something, or want to maintain their shape, again, I only focus on the three packages, which is one, the fit kit. That means someone wants to build muscle, they train hard, that's $299. If you want to lose weight fast, it's $249, transformation kit. Or if you want to maintain your shape, that's a core kit, that's $199. 
Those are the only three things I focus on. Right? And I let them, I let those people ask me if they want something else. Okay? So now for the threes, this is where we go. Again, this is at the home or you can do it in person. GST.vi.com. All right? Now, you have two ways to do this. If it's a challenge party, what you do is you have this PDF printed out. Again, you get that right from the website. You print it out, give it to the people there. Or if you are one on one sitting with somebody, okay, so someone doesn't come to a challenge party, but you go meet with them, you pull the sheet out and you say, okay, you know what? I'm going to just uh, quickly uh, uh, walk you to the training so you'll know how to get back the cost of your kit. And also, we can get you up to a rise of star or known as a director within the next seven days. Okay, so I'm going to assume that there is no video. Okay, but what I do with the video, okay, so if you press play, uh, press play, what I do is I will pause at every at every step where I need them to take action on the GST guide. Okay. And you can always practice on people with this. Okay. So just like last week where I said, you know what, this may not be for you. You saw, you can also go to people that you've already shared the stuff with and you know, they're not interested and you tell them, look, you know what? Uh, I need some practice. I'm going to be training a few people on my team and I just want to practice uh, going through the steps here. And I just need a guinea pig. I do my be, be my guinea pig. Okay. I know you're not in the business. I just need practice to do the training part. Okay. You're not presented anymore to people. You actually be training them. So you can actually walk them through this just so you can get a good handle of it. Okay. So again, very, very simple. This is GST stuff. They have the pen and paper in their hand. And again, those of you who've seen me do a challenge party, you know, I make sure anyone who's a three, I make sure they have a pen in their hand always. All right. So step one, put down your support team. I always get them to put in my name and my phone number and the name of the person who brought them to the event or who's introducing them to me and their phone number as well. I say, look, this is your support team. And I also tell them this. I say, hey, uh, lady or gentleman, whoever it is, if you never see us ever again, everything I'm going to go through with you today on this piece of paper, you can take this and get to the very top of our company. Okay. So I want you to listen to everything we tell you to do and start taking action. All right. So I showed them the support here. All right. So most people, what they normally do is they'll press play on the GST video or they will send them to a website and then say, Oh, the train is online. Okay. That's the biggest mistake you can ever make. If you want to show leadership skills, if you want to be taken as a leader, doesn't matter if you just joined today and you have, oh, you've joined eight months ago and you have no one on the team. Just by you walking your new person through this already makes you a leader because they don't know anything. So you're the one that's going to be guiding them through the different steps. All right. So name, phone number. Next step, I tell them, look, on Monday nights is a vision call. This is a call you want to be on to kickstart your week. Thursday night is your body by Vi challenge call. And this is for people who are either taking the challenge or you yourself also, if you're taking the challenge. Okay. So here's, um, here's, uh, uh, the call that you want your customers to be on as well. Okay. Now there's also an overview call. You can see right up there. Okay. That's a 9 PM from Monday to Friday. So every day at 9 PM, if you have new people as well, you can also send them on to this call as well. I don't know if it talks about business wise, but uh, I know for sure it talks about the challenge. Okay. I do have another number I give people as well for a team call for, for training calls. I'm not going to put that on here because we have a lot of different teams and it's actually another team's uh, number as well. All right. Um, then the next step is right here, setting your goals. Okay. This would be your why for joining the challenge. All right. So my 90 day challenge is whatever it is here. Now, so far to date, I've never had anyone tell me they have to think about it. Everyone has a 90 day goal. Maybe they don't want to tell you what it is, but everyone would love to look better naked. Everybody. I haven't met one person that doesn't want to. I mean, I want to look better naked, but that's me. 
I'm sure most people out there want to as well. Okay. So what I do is I tell them, I go, look, your 90 day challenge is anything that you want has to be health wise. Whether you want to walk five kilometers for breast cancer, maybe you want to lose weight fast, maybe you want to gain muscle, whatever it is, someone has a 90 day challenge. So what is your 90 day goal? Okay. If you don't have one, again, this is me pushing people away. If you don't have one, then to be honest with you, you shouldn't even think about joining this business. Right? So again, I'm always pushing people away. So a 90 day challenge goal, they write that in and I say, okay, next step, what you got to do is you want to go public. Now, most people I find I talk to are not actually doing Facebook stuff or whatever on their phone. So I just tell people the very next thing you want to do when you get home is you want to write this out on Facebook. And we have a whole Facebook strategy. Okay. Now later on, when I get my Facebook stuff on the on the site, on my uh, on the the site I'm going to be creating, you can then send your people to that so they can start to set up their Facebook wall the right way, and they'll know exactly what it is that they have to do. Again, those of you who came in late, the site is going to be at uh, workwithsuperdave.com forward slash vi. Let me just put that here again. It would be work with super Dave dot com forward slash V I for by Salas. All right. So uh, there'll be a link on there as well for training and under training. We'll have all the Facebook videos and stuff. So again, you won't have to worry about trying to teach a new person about what to do or how to do it and all that kind of stuff. And the videos will be pretty short. They should be anywhere from one to three minutes long on how to set up their wall, how to make it public, what to, next step to do, how to congratulate someone, how to comment on the wall, how to support the team, just different videos like that. Okay. So uh, where are we here? Okay, so, and I tell them also, make sure you add me as a friend on Facebook because as soon as you go public, I want you to message me on Facebook. Let me know you just went public so then I can blow up your wall. All right, um, and then, you know, next step, obviously, wear your bracelet. Now, the other part here, again, remember in the video, the DVD talks about each step, but I'm pausing the video and I make sure they do this. Okay, next step, a rising star. And I tell them, look, a rising star, all it means is simply you getting your money back for your kit ASAP. All right. So uh, Rise and Star, uh, for you to do that, what is your why? Now, those of you who've been here uh, a lot earlier, you notice I showed you the why. You know, your why has to be strong. Your why has to be so strong, like nothing will stop you. All right. So your why is normally for most people, it's some financial reason. Um, and I tell them, instead of writing down the dollar amount that you're looking to make, I want to know what the reason is behind the dollar amount. So if you're looking for an extra $1,000 a month, what is that for? Is that for you to be able to afford your mortgage? Is that for you to pay for a car? Is that for you to get groceries? What is that dollar amount for? So that's what you want the why to be. All right. And um, next is starting your list. And it says you need 25 people. What I do, again, I just want people to get started fast. I tell them, look, all you got to do is pick out your phone and check out the last five or 10 people who just called you. Put their names down. I, I actually say, I say, look, I don't need your, the phone numbers right now. And the reason I say that is because I want people just to feel comfortable, just to take action for them to get started. Okay, so I normally play a game if there's a group of people. I normally tell them, look, the first person, I want to know who the first person is to get to five. Who's going to be the first one? Okay, who's the first? And people just start challenging each other, okay? And normally you'll find the first person, they raise their hand up, I got my five. And then what do I do? Keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay, keep going. Who else? Who else got five? Who else got five? And, uh, you know, so then it just becomes a game. So what happens? Sometimes people start writing in five. They might get up to ten. When they get home, you'll find some people will write down two or three hundred names. But it started because you made them start. Now, next step after that is to schedule their challenge party. And I always tell people, I said, look, today's date is whatever the date is. I go in the next four to seven days, put down a date as to when you're going to do your challenge party. Doesn't matter if you don't know what to do or how to do it. I'm going to help you with that. Just put your date down. And as you can see here, for more information, go to party.vi.com. That'll teach you how to do a party. But I didn't even tell them that. I just said, put down the date. And then here, pre-party. 
okay, the reason I'm going through this is because some people are asking me, Dave, what website do I send a new person to? Uh, let me see, what is the question here? There's one about website, no one is, well, what do I say to somebody? Yeah, okay, someone said, no, what, what do I say to somebody uh, when I try and explain this to someone, okay? So, all that is all in here. So again, if I was pressing play on the DVD, the DVD goes through all this, and after the DVD goes through this, I pause it, and I tell them, I said, I say, when you start doing this business, okay, you're going to find, you're going to start asking, you might want to ask me, Dave, what do I say to this person? What if this person says this? What else do I say? The answer is always step number three. Whatever you want out of life, if you can master step number three, you can have it. If you want better relationships with people, do step number three. If you want to have more friends, do step number three. If you want to build a big business, do step number three. Whatever you want is in step number three. So, first exposure. Again, I'm using Sandra as my guinea pig here. All you do is you simply follow the steps here. Hey, Sandra, do you have a few minutes to talk? She's going to say, no. You say, great. Have a great day. I'll talk to you later. She says, sure. You say, hey, Sandra, look, I just found out. I just found out about a 90-day challenge. I don't say weight loss or fitness challenge. I just go, I say, I just found out about a 90-day challenge that I'm starting. My goal is to, whatever your goal is. Remember, you wrote your goal at the beginning. Now, this here's a little tweak. You can adjust your goal to try to fit the person you're speaking to. So, for example, if your goal is to lose weight, that is really what your goal is, and you think the person you're talking to might be maybe interested in that or maybe getting fit or something like that, then you can say that. My goal is to lose, uh, you know, uh, 23 pounds. And again, I always tell, I, well, I don't always tell people, but I'm telling you, if you want to make it intriguing, change the pounds you're trying to lose. Make it an odd number. So you all know, for me, I want to lose 19.7 pounds because the comment is always the same. Oh, 19.7? Why not 19.8 or 19.5? Like, you know, they always make a joke and because I've got them, okay? So, you know, maybe you want to lose 21.3 pounds, all right, in the next 90 days, all right? Uh, if it's someone young and you think they might be interested more in a car, my goal is to earn a BMW within the next 90 days. Again, you just choose choose what's going to fit with the person you're talking to. So you have to hear about this. Do you have a few minutes right now? They say, sure, great, I'm going to, and then boom, bring them up here. I'm going to put you on that vial line. It's a four-minute call, and I'll be on the line with you. So you link them up to the call. On this call, there's two, two different calls. One's a more excited call, and one is more a fact call. Put them on the call, depending on the individual. Put them on the right call for them. Choose the call. Listen to it. When that's done, second exposure. What did you like best about the Vi line? Great. Are you open to more information? If Sandra says no, say no problem. Listen, have a great day. We'll talk to you later. She says yes. Okay. You need to check this out. Then you give her your website. Okay. Uh, the website I normally use is the... Um, name.bodybyvi.com. That's the website I use. Uh, everyone has different websites. If you check in your back office, you have a bunch of different websites, but they're pretty much all the same. They just have different um, different uh, wordings on it. So let me let me do uh, super. Vi. So this is the one I use. The Body by Vi has this video on there. It's uh, pretty plain and right to the point. Um, I think others have. Why can I not click on here? Is anything clicking? No. Great. Okay. I'm hoping my stuff is not frozen. Can you hear me? Let me be sure. There we go. Okay. Uh, my vi.net. Let me see. Others choose this site. It's uh, your name.myvi.net. And again, it has the same video here, but it has more explanation about the products and uh, just more information down below about your kit, 
and a whole bunch of other stuff. And again, my computer is kind of slow in down here, which is not good. All right, there we go. Okay, so it has all about the videos, uh, just a whole bunch more information, stories, all that kind of stuff. So some people like using this site as well. Okay, so it's again your name dot myvi dot net. Again, it's totally up to you uh, what you want to use. Okay, so after she checks out again, I'm just getting her to watch the video. That's why I use the first website. So it checks out the first video, then I can call her back. Remember, video is only about five minutes long. Hey Sandra, what did you like best about the video? Great, are you open to more information? You see, you keep on asking if they're open to more information. And the reason you want to do that is because you're approaching them from a very, uh, I don't even know what the word is. You're not threatening them. You're not pushing them into anything. You're sharing something with them and you're asking their permission if they're open to more information. At any time, they could have always said no. She says, yes, great, we're having a get together. You'll be able to taste the shake and meet some of the people we're working with. And then you give her the time. In this case, I would give her the time and location for my next challenge party, okay? And it says here, if they don't show up, guess what? You take the party to them, all right? So I hope that answers the question of what you say to people. Always come back here to step number three, pre-party, pick two and party. So when the video is done, I go, I go over this again with the guest, all right? Then I let the DVD play. It talks about additional promotional, uh, party promotional ways, different ways of promoting your next party. I let that play. And then when it comes here, register for the next event. This year, when it's done, I pause it again. And then I tell them, I go, look guys, I saw this at Vitality. I just saw this back in July, which is only about uh, nine weeks or so ago. And that's when my eyes was open because I've, I've heard, I've known about this business for five years and I've always said, no, not interested. Thank you, but I'm not interested. Thanks, but I'm not interested. And it wasn't until I went down to this big event, the Vitality, where I saw regular people succeeding and I totally understood that it wasn't about the product. It was about the challenge. Once I got that, everything changed because then I understood because I never understood why Vysals was growing so much. I mean, okay, great. Yeah, people get BMWs. Yeah, okay, people are losing weight, but so what? Why are they exploding so much? And once I came there, I understood the culture. So what you want to do is you want to get you want to get people to come out to these events. And more importantly, you actually want them to bring people to the events. So local events, to get more information, go to events.vi.com. Regional events, go to regional.vi.com. All right. And then national events. So we have one coming up November 2 to 4. I'm hoping everyone on this, if you're in Vaisalas, will come out to the national event. This one is going to be huge. Okay, someone wants me to repeat the first address. It is whatever your username is, dot bodybyvi.com. National dot, there we go. I'm telling you guys, if you did not plan on coming, oh, hold on, this is the wrong one here. Okay, this here is another event. It's called the ND Experience. It's for people who hit the national director. So uh, if you're not national, you still have a few more hours. In fact, you have a six hours left to become national. And at the national event, they're going to be throwing together some crazy party at uh, Ryan's house. So Ryan, the CEO, he's going to be doing a party at his house as well. There's people who hit the national director position. Again, you want to be there for that. But St. Louis, which would be at national, national.vi.com. Okay, this here is the event you want to come out to. I am told, okay, this is November 2 to 4, 2012. I am told there's going to be more people at this event than what I saw in Miami. In Miami, I saw 18,000 people. And the ticket for that was $299. Here we have it's only $69. And we have a couple for $109. If you are in Toronto and you want to go, we do have a bus uh, leaving from Toronto. It's about $120 or so. And that's to take you there and bring you back. 
uh, it's going to cost you way more than that if you want to take a plane or drive your own car. Okay, so uh, just to let you know, this will be the wrap up, the last big event before the end of the year where they're going to be announcing the, the winners of the, 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 the challenges that happened back in, in uh, Miami. And it's going to be a new announcements of new challenges happen, happening. Plus, you can also kickstart your own challenge at the event as well. You're going to have uh, people who hit new levels. You'll be going across stage for every single person who, if you became director or whatever it is, everyone's going to be going across stage being recognized as well. So you want to make sure you come to St. Louis. I will be there for sure with a whack load of people. And I hope you plan on being there as well. Okay. So, um, Remember, this is still during the training. I'm telling people that you they have to be there. I would rather someone even came down to the event, even if they were not in the business, because after they come to the event, they will know if they want to do this business or not. Okay. So same thing. If you're in the business, there's nothing stopping you from bringing two or three other people with you in your car, driving to St. Louis uh, from Toronto. Anyway, it's only 13 hours. You're gonna do that anyways. So just bring people down there. Let them see what you saw, and I promise you your business will change overnight. For, for me, in Miami, we took 25 people there. And out of the 25 people, 19 of them became BMW qualified all within two to three weeks because of what they saw. They did not get excited because of me. They got excited because of what they saw for themselves. Okay, So you want to make sure you register yourself for that national event. And that's how I do my GST training. So this is what I do with a new person after they have decided they are a number three. So everything I just walked uh, with you, walked through with you, I took last 30 minutes to do that. You can do this with them in person or you can press play on a DVD and just pause it after each step to make sure that they write down the steps of whatever it is they need to do. All right. So uh, with that, I um, hope I came in loud and clear. Uh, what you want to do, like I said, oh, the website. I don't know which website you're talking about here. Uh, Kim. Okay, a different website. Okay, so for now, I'm going to be working on this website right now, the uh, workwithsuperdave.com forward slash vi. On that site, I'll have last week's training video. So those of you who are not on our team, you'll get access to that. Plus, I'll have a few other videos on, um, you know, presenting or maybe teasing people about the business, some information so people can make informed decisions as well. Because for me personally, I don't believe people should join on hype. I think people need to get the right information to make an informed decision to get involved in a business. This business is the simplest thing I've ever seen out there to do. It is going to be one of the hardest thing you will ever do, but it is the simplest thing to do. The hardest thing we do is talk to people all right so someone is asking me if the vi line is a toll free number the answer is no the vi line is not a toll free number but again uh for people in the u.s most of them on their cell phone they can call anywhere in the u.s on that number and it's it doesn't cost anything uh if you're in canada you can get a plan for like, i think like ten dollars or maybe even 20 bucks where you can call anywhere in canada in the u.s depending on your phone plan some of them already include that um, again, so that is that. All right. So with that, ladies and gentlemen, I am done. But, you know, if anyone has other questions, I'm just going to, uh, uh, yeah, I'll stop my recording here, but I'll be here to answer questions. I did promise you I'll be done by nine o'clock. Again, I hope you got something from this. My next uh, webinar will not be till, uh, I don't even know when, another two weeks or three weeks from now, because we will be in, uh, Hollywood for our own ND experience. Uh, let's see, ND experience, ND experience. National, that was the other one I had here, national director. So we're gonna be going to Hollywood. We'll be at the Ryan's house. We're gonna take lots of pictures, lots of videos. And um, I tell you guys, do whatever you can to get to the level of ND or above because it's gonna be awesome. Uh, no matter what, please, please register for st louis and uh if i see you you know let's take a picture together let's do some videos all that cool stuff and again you can use all that as social proof to put onto your facebook wall so with that i'm gonna say you guys have a great night 
and Mr. Hawaii. I'm gonna see you there. Oh, and just in case you wanna speak to me, anybody here, let me give you my phone number, just in case. All right, so you can call me or message me on Facebook. All right, make sure you become my friend. Uh, all right, guys, take care. You guys make this an awesome night, and we will talk to you later.